Hello guys, today I'm going to talk about the side-to-side -side VPN. So what is a side-to-side -side VPN? Uh, I would like to draw the uh, topology here. First of all, like, uh, I got company, uh, two companies. We got company A and company B. This is the A and this is the B. So uh, I am the owner of the company. So I want both of my company to uh, have the connectivity with each other. I mean, uh, the land inside that company or is going to uh, have connectivity with the land inside uh, company based on that okay so there are many ways to do that uh, I can implement the uh, I, I can rent the ISP in my local country uh, and do the list line something like that for example something like that so this is the list line I would like to say LL is mean the list line but it's going to cost me a lot of money. I don't want to do that. So I'm going to do another another thing. I, I maybe is uh, uh, easier, and uh, I don't have to waste a lot of money uh, just on uh, that thing. So another way we call it as the oops, wait. How can I delete that? Really? Wait, wait, wait. Sorry. Okay. I used the wrong tool actually. Okay, just okay. Something like that. So, uh, there's an, another way is that both the company I'm going to connect to the ISP. So I, I would say this is the internet here. I don't care what ISP that they used. It's just the, the internet. Okay, internet here. Okay. So when they had the connectivity, something like that. Uh, both of them must have the edge of the public IP address here. Uh, at the edge of the a uh, route, so yeah, I mean the border route, so must must implement, uh, uh must have the IP address and there. So they going, to, uh, they they going to build the uh a virtual tunnel here between each other here. Okay, they use the virtual tunnel. Is is this the logical one that we cannot see actually? Is this the logical? Okay. So, so uh, so when we want to send data from, from, from a com company A to the company B, that I'm going to to go through the tunnel okay from company A to company B and that data is going to encrypt it so what does it what does it mean encrypted encrypted means it's going to convert from the data that that, that we understand uh, to the something that uh, uh, that that human will understand even even the some even the machine unless they have the encryption code I mean they have the key to uh, 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 reconvert it I mean the key to decrypt it something like that so, uh, actually, I, I'm, I have the, uh, the lab that I, I have prepared to show you guys. I'm going to draw again. So, uh, I have the router. Uh, here, this is the router one that is used. And another router is the router three, router number three. And I, I assume that the router number one is the border router of the company A, something like that. Okay, company A. And the router three is the border router of the company. Uh, company B, okay, and uh, I I I do the land first of all. The the, the land inside the company A is the uh, 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 one dot one dot one dot one, and the land inside the company B is the um, three dot three dot three dot three, okay. And both of them have the connectivity. Uh, they connect to the internet something like that, okay. And so when I try to send data from the uh, LAN, local LAN 1.101 to the 3.3.3, .3 it's going to create a, a, a virtual tunnel between each other or something like that, okay? And then data is going to send across that uh, virtual tunnel here. Um, and what, I, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to uh, uh, catch, I mean, I'm going to uh, uh, capture the data inside the tunnel and going to show you that we, 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 we can see the encryption of the data alright so right now um, I have the uh, uh, router here in the screen on the front of the screen uh, make sure you can see you guys can see okay so as you can see this is the router one here and this is router 3 here uh, using the command from um, so on the router one, I'm going to say ping uh, 3.3.3 I'm going to say source 101 something like that when, when I type when I hit enter, it's going to say, okay, I, I can ping it a uh, 5.5.5.5. Five, 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 five. So I'm going to use the fire, fire shot to capture this this data. Uh, what I can do is that I'm going to uh, open the wire shot here. 
as you can see that this is the the, the packet that I just uh uh sent from one to one to one to three to three to three and as you can see this is the packet that I, that I have captured uh using the virus shark. So you can see is that uh, I don't uh, I, I I don't even know that what protocol that I used to send from some destination. It just uh, showed me that the protocol is the ESP. It means the encapsulating security payload. It is just the uh, apply on. The, so it uh, the IP6 is going to encrypt that data, and I cannot understand what the data that I'm going to send. You can see. I don't even know uh, about the payload. I mean, I don't even know about the what that what kind of data is. So it just showed me the you know. SP, uh, ESP, SPI, and some of code and the sequence number is just the uh, useless thing that we need to know. Alright, uh, this is the thing that I want to show you that the side of the VPN is secure and uh, it is very valuable and we don't have to spend a lot of money to have the connectivity with each other from one, from one company to another company, something like that. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you very much.